In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you three options, spotlight or search light, infographic slide in PowerPoint. And this is how the slide works. As you can see here, I have added a dark teal color for the slide background. And when I click, you can see the first spotlight comes. You can see the, the effect of the light. And then I have added one icon like a mother holding a baby. And then you can see add your uh, detailed text and then you can see here the next spotlight I have uh, used this icon where a father is holding the hand of his uh, a son or a daughter and then the third one he is just playing okay so this kind of information you can just provide with this help of uh, this kind of animation so I have added one more slide where I have used a dark background you can see here the black color and I have put some the body parts icon here so depending on your requirement you can just change the icons or the text and if you have not subscribed to my channel powerpoint university please subscribe it now and make sure to enable the bell notification icon you can join my telegram group with the help of this link and if you like to contribute to my channel you can do it through paypal or patreon the link is provided in the video description section add a new slide and change the background color to any background color of your choice so let me just right mouse click go to format background under solid fills i'm going to choose the color which is the dark teal here any color of your choice you can choose it then go to insert shapes i'm going to select the oval shape here draw the oval shape depending on your requirement make this much size shape outline make it no outline and shape fill i'm going to make it white i'm going to add one more uh, oval shape select the oval shape now hold the shift key so that you get a perfect circle here again shape outline make it no outline and shape fill make it white so what i'm going to sh uh, show you here is this is the light and then this is the 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 spot the spotlight whatever you can say here and then you know that the kind of the light effect comes from this so let me just put it like this anyway you can put not a problem then go to insert shapes from the basic shapes i'm going to select the trapezoid you can see here draw the trapezoid over this spotlight you can see here and then shape outline make it no outline and shape fill you can make it white and then i'm going to increase the transparency level all right now what you can do is actually the the light effect should come from this you know so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to select this right mouse click and edit point let me just zoom for you you can see here then i'm taking this point and i'm just going to put it here and this point i'm going to drag it here something like this so you can see here something like this it will look all right now it's very easy for me whether if you want to make it duplicate you can just press ctrl d to duplicate and then i can just add one here again press ctrl d one more now this time i want to rotate this you can see here it should go start from this side from the right and then i'm just going to move this light effect here or the light itself and then for this i want to start from the center somewhat center so again i'm just going to right mouse click edit points let me just zoom here you can see here i can just put it something like this all right so you can see here i've added three different spotlights uh with the light effect and now it's time to add any text or icon or any photo of your choice for that let me just go to insert icons again this icon feature is available in only the latest version of powerpoint if you're using the old powerpoint version then this feature will not be available so i'm just going to choose maybe a random uh icons you can see here any icons of my choice i can just choose it maybe i can just choose these three example let me just move this here and i'm going to make as white sorry i have to make it black not white my mistake so let me just delete this again i'm selecting all this and make this as black then i'm just going to put you can see here the lungs here i'm going to put the heart here 
and then the kidneys to this side all right and then go to insert text box you can add your detailed text here I'm going to choose a light font you can see here so it will be visible with the background and then I'm just going to keep it here press ctrl D or you can just ctrl shift hold and just add like this all right ctrl shift together you have to hold it and then just drag it so now you can see here the basic design is ready now it's time to do the animation so I'm going to close the format background, go to the animations, enable the animation pane. First, I'm going to select this one, add animation, I'm going to say appear, okay. And then for this, I'm going to add animation, which is the wipe. You can see the wipe here and wipe, it should start from top and this should happen after previous and double click this one the timings i'm going to make it more faster so it's zero instead of 0.5 i'm going to make it 0.2 and press enter key so it comes very fast and then this spotlight should come again spotlight i can give a, maybe a fade effect so let me just click on the fade effect here you can see here and this also i'm going to make it very fast which is 0.2 and this should happen after previous and click ok you can see here and then i'm going to select the icon add icon maybe again for this also i'm going to use a wipe all right this is also should happen after previous again double click this one timings again this also i'm going to make it 0 0.2 and then this text i'm going to more entrance effects stretch click ok and it should come from top and this also should happen maybe with previous or if you want to retain the same uh, duration not a problem so let me just show you how it works now when i click you can see uh, it works something like this all right so now it's very easy for me to copy the animation to the other option. So I'm just going to select this animation painter, click on that one. I'm going to click on this. Then I'm going to select this light. You can see here, then I'm going to select the oval shape. I'm going to select the icon. And lastly, I'm going to select the detailed text. So it's very simple so let me just do it once again so i'm just going to select this one copy to this again select this copy for this particular oval shape the icons and then the last the detailed text all right so let me just play now you can see here it comes something like this so it's very easy and simple way to do the animation effect